seek his advice. Seek his advice. Involve your husband in your decision-making process. He will feel valued. Show him that you value his suggestions and opinions. Number two, remember his preferences. If you have stayed long enough with your husband as you seek his advice, remember his preferences. When you take his advice, remember his choices so that the next time you know, next time you know what he wants. Number three, compliment him. Let me ask you honestly as a wife, when was the last time you complimented your husband? Number four, practical way to respect your husband. Understand his job. Understand his job. Take an interest in your husband's career and professional duties. Number five, be open-minded. Be open-minded. Are you open-minded, my dear sister? Be open to your husband's ideas and opinions. Do not brush them aside. Don't brush his suggestions aside. Number six, practical way. Be oral about your admiration. Be verbal, be oral. Never hide your admiration for him. You might admire him, but it's of no use if you do not let him know about it. The seventh practical way of showing respect to your husband is that support his goals as a wife. Support his goals as a wife. God created you as a helmet and your husband has goals. You need to support them. Number eight practical way, seek his forgiveness. You may be wrong in your decisions or deeds sometimes. You may have hurt him with the choice of your words. So rather than overlooking the situation, be thoughtful and apologize to your husband. Number nine, practical way. Listen to him. I'm talking to wives. I'm talking to you ladies. Listen to your husband. When your husband wants to have a conversation with you, give him your full attention. Practical, number, practical way number ten. To respect your husband, do not criticize him in front of others. Do not criticize your, your husband in front of others. This is the worst thing you can do to respect your husband. No matter what your husband must have done, you have no right to insult him in public. Talk to him privately to explain where he went wrong. 